Sam, we have a damning court document. Tell me about that. Yes, that's right, Dr. Drew. From the family court, I have it right here. And the document lists Charlie's father and stepmother allegedly involved in his disappearance. So according to Child Protective Services, Charlie's stepmother put him in that basement barricade and told him not to come out no matter what he hears. That's the kid saying that? Yes, that's the kid t telling Child Protective Services that. All right, Nikki, you buy it? Dr. Drew, let me, let me just take this approach with it. You know, one thing that really disturbed me with this story was athletically. Now, I kind of come from a sports background. What really disturbed me with this, it seems like this kid sadly got used to the abuse by his father. And, you know, I, I read where he pushed him athletically, sometimes to tears on the elliptical a few times. He was 12 years old. I think with this story, there is clearly a line of abuse. The kid, when he was told to go downstairs, he knew what would happen if he didn't. I think the stepmom is equally to blame as the aggressor as well. And, so and so more, what? Wait, wait, remorse. Nikki, are you making a case that this is something the parents staged, like Balloon Boy? So Balloon Boy and Basement Boy, same thing, and the parents threatened him if he didn't go down there? Yeah, I, I, I do. About, I really about, do. I can think of two other scenarios, Vanessa, where he went down there to hide because the guy was abusing him with a PVC pipe. Or um, mom was abusive, too, and he was hiding out from both of them. Absolutely. Now, this is mm -hmm. the proof that cases need. This is completely suspicious. The boy was pushed beyond what is normal for athletic build. He was pushed to do 4,000 steps on an ellipt elliptical. You brought up the PCC, PCV pipe, PVC. I believe. P Plastic there we go. Pipe. He's and got he a chunk out of his chest. Him. He claims it with a chunk out of his chest, he's, there's blood on the PVC. He had bruises on his buttock from the PVC Aww. beatings. Let's not call this discipline. This is beatings. Absolutely. Lonnie, yeah. why? Now, there's not been any arrest made in this case. Yeah. How, how come? There's a damning court document. No one's been accused of anything yet. Right. What's going on here? Well, what they've done so far is they've taken the children away from these two people. They have two other children. They've been taken out by um, Child Protective Custody Services. And then this child, the son, Charlie, has been taken to his biological mother. But what the police are doing are exactly what they need to do. Look, there are a lot of holes in this story. We have the story that's coming from the 12-year-old boy about how the stepmother put her, him down there. Yeah. But there's a lot of other theories. He was downstairs in this basement that had a tunnel to the outside. There was a bathroom down there. The police said when they came to see and found him, it didn't seem like he'd been down there the whole time. They'd searched that well, basement well, many times. Okay. So there's some other theories that perhaps the stepmother put him down there to protect him from the father's abuse. Yep, that's there's right. There's also another theory that actually perhaps he ran away and was just hiding in the basement at night and going out and playing basketball and finding food during well, the day because there are some witnesses that say, hey, we saw him playing basketball. So all of these leads need to be tracked down and checked out before they file those charges. They don't want to rush to judgment on this. Bottom line, they need to do that investigation. Vanessa, right. Vanessa, the kids that run away and stay away are being abused in the home. That's Absolutely. the way that works. Absolutely. And we're but, missing two other things. Mm -hmm. the, the fact that the attorney is almost blaming the child, saying he was a bad kid. Yeah, that is, well, that doesn't happen. That's the, that. that's the other possibility uh -huh. that the kid is a psychopath in the making and that oh, he's manipulating no. the whole no. thing. Hey, You've got listen, hey wait, is Emmy coming up next? Emmy's coming up next. I will, I will ask her specifically about this. She's jaded me from the Ray other story, Lush. for God's sakes. I, I wouldn't normally already... think about that, but Vanessa, finish your thoughts. No, I'm saying the mother. She's a shady character. She's in jail now. She was on probation. Like, there are clear red flags that this couple was doing something very bad mm -hmm. to this child that he wanted, he needed to get away. Sam. Yeah.